Does Bermudez have another miracle in him? Or will Kiyaguchi return to form here tonight? Round one, our main event is underway. Scheduled for 12. Hiroto Kiyaguchi in the black and orange Naruto themed trunks. Esteban Bermudez in the black trimmed with gold. And Kiyaguchi just landed a good left hook to the body. Guys are just filling each other out right now. Kiyaguchi showing off some of that body work. It is his hallmark here in the early going. Lots of angles, lots of hooks to the body. And a particularly good uppercut in both hands. We saw Esteban Bermudez drag Carlos Canizales, who's one of the prettiest boxers that we've seen at 108 over the last few years, really dragged him into a war. Really the question is, can he drag Kiyaguchi into those kinds of depths as well as he digs to the body? Kiyaguchi just counted with a good left hook. And he's just taking a sign close. Nice combination right there. Sticking to the jab. Hands up, showing good defense so far. Good jab, one, two. Shots on the inside from both fighters. Bermudez digging to the body. Oh, nice uppercut. It's a, it's a couple left right up because the Kiguchi has landed. Two fights ago, Kiyaguchi had some scary moments against Tetsuya Hasada. And what Hasada was doing in that fight was making it hard for Kiyaguchi to enter, but also throwing sweeping shots like the one that Bermudez just tried, the one he specializes in. Kiyaguchi steps out. Bermudez looking for uppercuts as well. Nice right hand. That's Kiyaguchi. Crowd here in Guadalajara coming alive. Fully in support of Esteban Bermudez. Nice body punch by Kiyoguchi. Yeah, he's, pick, body punch. yeah, he's picking his shot smart. Right there, he just he throws a right hook to the body that comes up with a right uppercut, left uppercut, punches and bunches, different angles. You know, he's, uh, he's a smart fighter. Just constant motion from both men. Nice uppercut. I don't know why uh, there was a break there, but wow. Pops the head back of Bermudez, does Kiyoguchi. Kiyaguchi starts to flurry. Yeah, Kiyaguchi's stepping on the gas right now, man. He's, he sees blood and he's going for the kill. Man, he's in full control right now, man. He's so poised. I, I, I like the way he lets his hands go. Good distance. There's, there's a, the uppercut. He doesn't miss. Just ripping uppercuts from both hands. Final 15 seconds of round two. As Kiyaguchi has really stepped on the pedal in the last minute and a half of this round and the blood starts to pour down the face of Esteban Bermudez. He's letting his hands go, but is on the receiving end of a serious beating by way of uppercut <laughs> by Hiroto Kiyaguchi through six minutes in this fight. But you know, right now, he's just flowing. He's in a rhythm. He has a great pace going on. He's in full control. Touching with the jab, look, double in the jab. Nice combo right in the bottom. Man, just, he's a technician right now. Look at that. Those are left, those are left hook with a right uppercut behind it. Final 30 seconds of round three in your right game. Two members of Bermudez's corner clutching towels yep. pretty tightly right now. Yeah, you know, their fighter's taking a hell of a beating right now. And Kiyokuchi's not going to slow down. And I think the doctor's going to take a look at the face of Bermudez. It is just gushing blood. And I don't think it's from just one place. Got some blood from the hairline, around the eyes. 
stiff jab from Kiyaguchi and a right hand over the top. Man. These guys are these guys are probably throwing 100 punches in this round. Such an active round. Yeah, it might be north of 100 <laughs> for both men. Bermudez, a courageous effort, looking for a life-changing victory here tonight, and he connects on the left hook. A confidence booster for Esteban Bermudez. And Kiyoguchi just keeps doing what he's doing. Bermudez can survive into the later rounds. Yeah. Remember, the concern we were talking about for Kiyaguchi and his camp about the altitude, and let's not forget how hot it is here in the venue as well. You know, it's a it's a high intense fight, but these guys are thinking in there, man. The technique is great. It's a big. Keep your hands up at all times. He made a mistake right there, and you killed what you made him pay for it. But somehow, Bermudez, just unreal toughness from Bermudez, bounces right back and is flurrying away at Kiyaguchi. And the doctor's going to have a look at Bermudez again. He is just taking a savage amount of punishment and somehow continuing to move forward. Yeah, man, there's just blood splatter all over our desk. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a bloody war. So this is the kind of fight that you expect in a sweltering hot gym in Mexico. Hiroto Kiyakuchi hammers Bermudez down to the canvas. This is hurt, he's wobbly. And the referee ruling that those were shots behind the head, oh, and he's man. gonna give Bermudez a reprieve here in the neutral corner. Oh wow, Kiyaguchi, another point deducted. That's two points taken away from Kiyaguchi. You, you know, know what? I think if that last shot hadn't landed, yeah. that might have oh, been... It's over. It's and over. I, that might have been a knockdown. But look at this. Kiyaguchi is going for the kill. All over punches Bermudez. And punches. Wow. Bermudez barely oh, hanging man. on. Kiyaguchi man, just Kiyaguchi. won't stop. He's an animal. Wow. It's, that is it. It's over. Man. A savage performance from the Mad Boy. Savage. Savage. Look at that. Look at that. Just letting his hands go and punches all angles. Is, it's a beautiful thing. You know, he's a killer. He's a finisher. Magnificent performance from Kiyaguchi as we get one more look at this. You see both men just covered in blood. Kiyaguchi just never stopped punching. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Roberto Ramirez Jr. calls a halt to this contest. The official time of the stoppage, 24 seconds of round number eight. Your winner by TKO and still the WBA and Ring Magazine Live Flyweight Champion of the World.